You did drop E zero, right? Because he, yeah, I dropped it. Yeah, yeah I'm done. With you. Warner Brothers plans to expand the production of anime to what? Warner Brothers plans to expand their production of anime to more than 10 series per year. How big is their staff, bro? What the fuck? Yo, how big is their staff? How? Hold on. Warner Brothers Discovery to expand anime production in Japan. In Japan, the genre is increasing reach and relevance globally. Exclusive. Warner Brothers Discovery. We have a Japanese anime studio which has been producing four to ten anime series per year over the last few years said James Gibbons, WBD, president of Asian Pacific. We've approved expansion expansion to take that to take that to more than 10 series per year. How many titles do they work on every wait really? Hold on. How like how big is Wait. Warner Brothers Dis Okay. Warner Brothers the Okay. Thirty-five thousand three hundred. Like a conveyor belt, yeah. But if people want the projects, they'll get the projects. And they're up this year, in terms of revenue. Income is down. Net income is down. Total assets are down. Total equity is down. But they made more revenue, for sure. But they have 35,000 people on staff. I don't know how many in Japan alone, but they have people. That's for sure. Because I was like, yo, are they going to take like a small, I mean, like, I guess it's Warner Brothers. So it wouldn't be small, but like, are they going to just work these guys to the fucking bone? But no, it looks like they're actually expanding. It's important to read this kind of shit. We have a Japanese anime studio which has been producing five to ten anime uh, series per year over the next uh, over the last few years," said James Gibbons, WBD, president of Asia Pacific. We've approved expansion to take on to take that to more than ten series per year. The studio has been operating uh, operational since 2011 uh, and discovered over 80 titles in that span, a mix of high quality anime, live action series, and movies. These include JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Which was originally serialized in they had a problem with that, huh? Uh, in a manga magazine starting in 1987, it became an animated series that launched in 2020, uh, 2012. The record, of, oof, the record of Ragnarok series and uh, and a Batman Ninja anime movie, which I think actually is, is apparently pretty good. So check check Big X. We've sold them to third parties that have been one of the okay. That's okay. So that's that's important too. We sold them to third parties that has been one of the metrics, and they are doing very well, said Gibbons. And so, because we see the appeal of that cat of the category, we are expanding it. Anime is one of the best ways to reach the 18 to 30 year old audience, which is incredibly uh, elusive. Really? Uh, uh, globally, uh, hold on. Actually, uh, maybe that's... Uh, hmm. Globally, I'll bet, not every market, but certainly in the U.S., parts of Europe, Latin America... We've got strong anime audiences. Both JoJo's Rick and Ragnarok are currently on Netflix and have ranked strongly. Yeah, I, I, no. Ranked strongly featuring. Uh, maybe I'm wrong about Rick and Ragnarok. Uh, featuring the streamer's glo Global Weekly Top 10. How? Okay. 
there is Japanese anime that comes from original IP, but there's also anime that comes from elsewhere. And we've looked at our DC universe and said, can we take these characters and reinvent them in a world of world of anime? Which is not straightforward because you have to do it the right way. You have to work with the right studios to make it happen and build and to uh, and to build your fan base. Said Gibbons. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna see more fucking goddamn DC animes. The DC movie franchises—they're done. Guess the fuck what? Anime, hardcore. The studio is putting the finishing touches on Suicide Squad Isekai, a new original anime series based on the characters from DC. It is produced by Warner Brothers Japan and which studio? The, uh, the celebrated Japanese studio behind Global Hit Anime Series, such as Attack on Titan Season 1 through 3, and Spy X Family, decorated by Osada Eri from the screenplay of uh, Nagatsuki uh, Tape. Tape? I think so. The series will release in Japan in July with entry to international markets to follow at an, uh, at an unconfirmed date closer to the year. So even though it's an American base or American oriented franchise, DC, Suicide Squad, it's going to be in Japan first and then later to roll out internationally. The story sees, I don't care. Okay, so, because I, I, just, I just need to hear if it's good or not. Okay. Huh. At first, I was skeptical, honestly, and I was worried about the staff, but according to what they're saying, they're going to expand it. They're going to actually increase the number of employees working on this sort of content, and they're going to roll out a lot of the DC stuff that people, let's say, wanted to see in anime format. And so if this is good, like if I hear that this is actually good, like pretty, like the best Suicide Squad content that we've seen to date, that kind of good? But you could argue it's honestly a high bar. But if it is, okay. There's, some, there's some, something to be said here. Okay. Because it now means that they can produce a lot of different shows and movies, not just shows, but also movies as well, um, at a pretty good rate. So we'll see. Weekly Shonen Jump author comments at the passing of, Tuga of Kira Toriyama on March 1st, 2024. The messages are, the messages are all published in Weekly Shonen Jump issue 17. Yes. Right now, he's, uh, right, yes. Yeah, so all this, this one that, 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 I re -read, that I read during the chapter. Oh, my fucking eye. Okay, here we go. Right now, he's got a halo on his head, and he's saying, sure, it is tough to be a mangaka while building models without a care in the world. I salute you, Ichiro Oda. And I, I salute you. That's from, from, from a chair Oda. One piece. I am unworthy of any words. Uh, may you rest in peace. Uh, Aku, Tommy, Gege, JJK. I will chase after you and your giant stature like Ariel would forever. Uh, Hitsuji Go Daira. Mission Yakuza Family. Toriyama-san's creations were always there for me growing up. May you rest in peace. Uh, Yoshi Fumi... To, tozuka undone luck when i was a kid i grew goku so much i would do it from memory may you rest in peace yuto uh suzuki sakamoto days everything toriyama sensei created is a treasure to me rest in peace from the bottom of my heart shohei miyazaki me and roboko this manga is still pl uh, pulsing through my very blood may you rest in peace uh you say matsui who does i have no idea I can't even calculate how much influence you had on me. I'm so sad. May rest in peace. Shin, uh, Shinohara Kenta, Witch Watch. I am drowning in sorrow from the news about Toriyama Sensei. I aspire to create his second to none designs to excite the world building. Miyuro Koji Blue Lock. It was so sudden that I am at a loss for words from the bottom of my heart. May rest in peace. Yuki, uh, Sune Gana, I think. Akane Bashi. I love Torama Sensei's art. May he rest in peace. Uh, Masoki Shindo, a Ryu Dragon. I doubt there's anybody who was not influenced by him. 
May Kira Tanama Sensei rest in peace. Uh, Takara, Takara Toshi Fujimaki, uh, Kill Blue. Bro, there are so many fucking goddamn I Grew Goku, Mad NA. Uh, it's, it's one out of like 1,000. There are so many different fucking goddamn series here. I've never heard my life, bro. Never heard my life. Oh, Blue Blocks. Sorry, I said Blue Lock. Blue Box. My ball. Did, did, did I say Blue Lock? Yeah. All right, so let's say two out of a thousand. Um, to me, you are a god with all my heart. Uh, so to me, to, to me, you are a god with all my heart. And so I pray that you rest in peace. Uh, Kawe Kotsu, uh, newest exorcist. I don't want to say that. Uh, Kawe Kota, yeah, Kawe Kota, newest exorcist. I made so many friends when I was a kid. Thanks to Dragon Ball. May you rest in peace. Yoshihiko Hayashi, Mama Yu. I was one of the terrible kids who would ask his parents for cash as a birthday present. But what could I do? I was addicted to Dragon Ball heroes. What the fuck? Takeru Hokazono Kagurabachi. Kagurabachi. The comments you gave me for the Tezuka Award are my treasure and my lifelong guide, uh, my, my lifelong guiding light. May rest in peace, Itsumata Elk, Two Aunt Ice. Karma Sensei gave, moved, and influenced me so much. May rest in peace. Uh, Terasaka Kento, green, green, greens. May you rest in peace. I mustn't cry until I can draw like him. Uh, Amayama Kento, shadow eliminators. I'm filled with so much grief that I still can't believe it's true. My deepest condolences, Numa Shun, super psychic policeman, Choji. Without Dragon Ball, I would not be here. May you rest in peace, Tarma Sensei. Matsui Rin, dear, uh, Anemone. I think I'm saying that right. Listen, there's a lot. Holy shit, there's so many different stories. Whoa! No Togashi, because Hunter Hunter's no longer shonen. No Black Clover, because those are not part of the shonen as well. So that's that's kind of sad, because I actually wouldn't want to see their comments on this um, if they haven't done so already. But, a lot. A lot of condolences, prayers, wishes, thank yous, respect for Akira Toriyama, the GOAT, the GBZ GOAT. And of course, obviously, we have to pay respects to one of the greatest ever do it. That's for damn sure. That's for damn sure. Uh, after that. Periot's 25th anniversary pop-up shop will be held at uh, Sui. Taya, 25th anniversary il illustration goods from Naruto, Boruto, Bleach, Yuakusho, uh, Hikari no Go, and Black Clover are available are now available. Details will be announced later on. Okay. Okay. You know, <laughs> Yami, Asta, Noel, Sakura, Kakashi, Sosuke Kun, Renji, Ichigo, Ichigo, Byakuya, who the fuck are you? Out of oh, um. Hikaru no go. That's what we get. These guys. Hikaru no go. Uh, Rukia. Okay. Where's Orihime? No Orihime? What the fuck? Damn, no Orihime? Naruto. Boruto. Hey, my fucking niggas. The four man unit. My boys. Hie Kubara. Yeah. Yuke Meshi. Kurama. Good shit. Yeah, Team Yura Meshi. I love to see it. There's no Orihime, bro. Damn. We have Renji, Rukia, and Ichigo. No Orihime. Renji, cover that shit up. God damn. Nigga has a fucking compressor shirt on. Like, what are you doing, bro? Be easy with him, Renji. Be easy. What? They put Byakuya instead of Orihime? What? Get rid of Boruto's ass. Get this nigga out of here, bro. Get Boruto, punt him off the fucking screen, and slide Orihime. Hey, let's get some more cancer in here. Mm -mm 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 
actually, hold on. Because it's going to cut that shit off. So, let me just do this. Let me mute this for you guys because I don't want to get a Vosh moment and have my fucking horse porn just exposed to you fuckers. That's not healthy. Okay. There's no hate, bro. Only love. I said it looks. I said it looks great. That's all love. That's all love, baby. I can't do the thing where it's like, oh, I can't. 